Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2022-23 Panini Mosaic Basketball. Six box, half case, pick your team five, half case from a fresh case right there. And if you follow the instructions and got an even number of teams, you'll get an entry to win this Prism Choice Box from 21-22. Right there, which is a really nice value. You think about the draft class there. You can We'll send it to you sealed. Winner will get it sealed. You can... You can uh, sell it if you want to. You can rip it open yourself if you want to. We'll do that randomizer at the end. Love the mosaic design. And this is my first look at it. There's William with double last spot mojo, Kings and Spurs. Good luck. Good luck to him, good luck to everybody. Now, it's sort of an awkward sized case here. Let's make myself a little room. The other half of the mosaic case, this is mosaic basketball, right? Yeah. The other half is in the store right now, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Um, we've got a good chance of doing that tonight. It's down to 12 teams already. So basketball fans, if you're interested, let's finish off that second half. Grab that scene right there. Empty case. Let's pull these back over here. So you can see that the uh, one, two, three, four, five, six top row, and then another six on that bottom row right there. We're gonna roll the die. We'll go one, two, three for the top row, and four, five, six for the bottom row. And it's four, bottom row right here. So top row. We'll say for break um, for break six, second half of this case. Again, we can do this uh, do this uh, later tonight. So we're doing this is pick your team five. All right, once again here are the team Duncan. What's going on, man? How are you? Good day to you. Yeah, Eric, it's it was pretty fortunate to be able to do this. I think all cards ship, yes, all cards ship. What are we looking for here? We're looking for one autograph per box on average. Ooh, nice, Duncan. Yeah, kick back and relax. Let's see what hoops hits we get out of here. Big fan of the mosaic. Yeah, you would definitely need a lot of, uh, you know, the Fanatics live stream is a little bit easier, but uh, running the, the, the YouTube rig is a little bit more complicated. Yeah, you definitely have to have some working knowledge of technology, more than working knowledge. Colin Sexton, not numbered. The Kuzma, not numbered. Kind of like this newspaper looking thing right there. And I guess basketball season is, is right around the corner, so it's Good to kind of start thinking about that. Got the, the rookie cards seem to not have color filled in there. I don't know if that was intentional or not. All right, this is 2022-23, so second year Cunningham's. Got to remind myself of the uh, 
draft class. So here's Kevin Porter Jr. That's number to 149. Rockets. That's going to be for Chris Butler. There's a Keegan Murray, AD, and LeBron. Keegan Murray, that's the key, uh, key king to be chasing. And we've got a blue Jonathan Kaminga to 199. And all of that will be top loaded and before they ship out. We've got Christian Braun, Shaden Sharp, Devin Vassell, Jordan and Wara. We got Dort. Red Mark is smart. And we got an overdrive SGA. I don't know how short printed or not those are, but that looks really sharp. And traditionally, it's a relatively common insert. Ooh, we're gonna start off with a nice one. That's the glove, Gary Payton. For the Seattle Supersonic, Supersonic stuff go to Chris Butler and OKC. I guess until Seattle gets their own team. All right, nice first auto of six. So we got a gold right here. That should be the 10, yeah, Josh Christopher, one out of 10. Josh Christopher for Chris and the Rockets. I'll do a quick little recap too at the end of the, at the, end of the break. And Julius Randle, purple, 62 out of 99. Nice, montage insert. That's for the Knicks, that'll be for William. And we got a nice Jaden Ivey, rookie silver. For Detroit, that's gonna be for Steve H. We got a blue Ryan Rollins to 199 for Golden State. That'll be for Chris. And we've got a montage Zion and a montage Giannis. And the Dodgers are down to their last out. Three runs down. Man on first, though. But yeah, if he. David Prawls could get on board. Mookie Betts could turn this into a tie game with one swing of the bat. Turn that lineup over, David Peralta. All right, next box. What's the outlook for Dalvin Cook this year? Meh, I think. See, the injuries are always a concern. You're always gonna have to We always have to contend with that. Oh, you're doing an auction draft. Not sure how much did you pay for it? And what was your budget? You can start, you can think about it as percentage of your budget. What percentage of your salary did da Dalvin Cook, uh, did Dalvin Cook uh, take? All right, James Altman steals second. $11 on a uh, $200 cap. That's not bad. And strikes out David Peralta. That's the game Dodgers lose. Damn. Once again, the red not numbered.
and a Paolo Bencaro. Is that a stained glass? I think so. These, these look nice. Orlando, Sean Maddox. Let's take a look at what the, I think there should be a picture on a, is that what the stained glasses look like? Yeah. It is. Wow. Someone's asking 600 for this. So that must be shorter printed, more shorter printed than I thought. I don't know how short printed this is, but there's only 10 players on the stained glass set checklist. Nice. It's a sharp looking card there. All right, onwards. Oh, that's the, I, I, I slept through one of our drafts on Sunday. One of my drafts on Sunday. It's a Keegan Murray mosaic pattern and Spencer Dinwiddie to 199. And auto drafted like three quarters of my team. Yeah, that's it, Rex. Dodgers season over. They lost to the Marlins. And we got a D'Anthony Melton purple to 99, seven out of 99 for the Phillies. This camera seemed a little, a little dark. Let's get the brightness just a tad bit here. No, Chad, I, I, I have no access to anything shipping-wise. So you're barking up the wrong tree, I'm afraid. You can hit that contact button on jazbeescasebreaks.com and reach out to us. You can also, uh, if you go to the schedule tab, I'm sure you are aware of the, of the break schedule. And if you look at the tabs on the bottom, there's a shipping tab. So you can find the date of when your break was, and then you can see what the status of that is. And that's for, not just for you, Chad, it's for everybody. Use that resource. Shipping team updates it at least once a night. There's a Chet Holmgren rookie card. That's for OKC, that'll be for Chris. It's a Paolo Bancaro. And a Razzle Dazzle insert. That looks pretty cool too. All right, sometimes I think that too, Duncan. I'm just like, you know what? Every time I prepare for this draft and spend hours on research and end up doing the draft and my team doesn't, still is not good. So yeah, maybe just auto draft it one year and then see what happens. All right, there's Jeremy Sohan and he reveals an out of 49, Derek Harper. Nice. Sixteen out of forty-nine, and there's a Danny Green gold, one out of ten, the first one ever made. Cavs, that'll be for Tristan. <laughs> those ratings, I, I feel like the, I feel like those ratings are are just AI generated content based off of like last season's, like how accurate are those ratings? I feel like they just use like average draft position. So you could have a bad draft, but as long as you're getting value, it's Danny Green to 149, right? As long as you're getting like, if the average draft position was 100 and you got him at 110 or something like that, then I think they always say 
I, I think that's what a successful draft is according to that algorithm. You know, combined with like name players, but I think it's usually, usually like what big names did you get? Stat projections, you know, which is, you, you never know. Um, and then average draft position. So if they think you reached on a draft too much, and they'll, they'll they'll ding you for that, which I don't know if it's, I don't know if that's fair. Just getting a little hydration here. Next box. All right, yeah, most people always out outperform their mark. Who does everyone have in this, uh, when is it, in two nights? Week one of the NFL season has begun. Very exciting. I know this is a basketball break, but there's no basketball happening right now. All right, I guess FIBA World Cup is happening right now. The United States crushed Italy. Well, that happens overnight. So we can kind of flow to a little, uh, little NFL chatter here. Are you nervous, Gilo? Chiefs will still win, right? But because of that, wow. Chiefs are now, they were at minus like seven. Now they're, Kelsey cost them two points, or minus five now. I luckily put an investment on the Lions at plus six and a half. I did that before the injury news. You're still more nervous about the defense. Yeah, Kelsey did make that appeal to Jones and said, hey, come on, man. Sign it, make the deal done. Get the deal done, help me out. Yeah, Eric was saying, Eric had an even hotter take. Eric just thinks outright, that they're just gonna beat your Chiefs, Gilo, outright. See you, have a good one, man. See you tomorrow. There's a redemption, any guesses on that redemption for bragging rights? Four out of 10, Lonnie Walker, number match. Jersey number. Nice. Lakers. Matt with my Lakers. That really awesome playoff performance right there. I'm feeling pretty bullish about my Lakers this year. Yeah, I don't know if the Lions are going to win outright. According to ESPN, they're saying the Lions have a 33.5% chance of winning this game. But that would be quite a week one upset. There's a Jared Vanderbilt, 29 out of 99. Vando, another Laker for, for Matt. Jabari Smith Jr. will go to Chris and the Rockets. And Jalen with an L, Jalen Williams, or without the Y, however you want to call it. The, uh, I think this is the more desirable Jalen Williams, the better one. Anyway, both will go to Chris and OKC. Bullish on Max Christie. Matt, had a nice summer league, could have a really nice season, bulked up a little bit. It's tough to win an arrowhead no matter what, I agree. But, it's a good, there, there are some NFL trends that I, that I usually go with in week one, which I'll go through in a second here. 29 out of 149, Evita Zubac. That's for the clip show. That'll be for Tristan. You're a Heat fan for basketball and a Seattle fan for football. How did, how did, how did that work out?
There's Seth Curry to 199. All right, no guesses on the redemption. It is AJ Griffin, rookie autographs mosaic blue. AJ Griffin is an Atlanta Hawk. That'll be for Adam and Atlanta. It just did, huh? Are you? Do you live in a in a in part of the world where you don't have a pro team close to you? I always wondered about that. If you don't live in a team in a in a place with a team close to you. And and if you're you know your if your parents don't have any pro team allegiance, you know you're like a sports you're like a sports fan free agent. All right, onwards. Oh, we were talking. I was going to talk to you about NFL trends. I was actually kind of working on this project a little bit late last night. I think a general trend, you know, and obviously take it with a grain of salt with depending on matchups and injuries and blah, 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 blah. So it's not like a blanket rule, but it's something to kind of consider. Road dog after a loss. Against the spread, they, the road dog covers 56.9% of the time. That's a pretty good clip. Here's, here's one that applies this year. The number one overall pick, the number one overall, if you're, a, if you're a QB that's picked number one overall, their week one against the spread is one and seven. One and seven. I don't know who that one win was or one cover was. But in week two, that same number one overall pick, quarterback, in week two, six and one against the spread in week two. So that would be uh, Bryce Young, I think, right? Bryce Young was picked one overall. So let's see if that trend holds true. Small sample size, but not too many quarterbacks drafted one overall. That, you might be able to extrapolate that into rookie QBs in general, making week one starts. There's DeAnthony Melton to 149 for the Sixers, Steve Herrick. Erickson, your dad's a 49ers fan, your sister and your girl are Vikings fans, your brother is a Jags fan. Where do you live, Eric? How, how, do, how does this happen? Nobody will guess who your cousin is, though. Cool. Don't need a guess. Chet Holmgren. That's kind of that's all over the place, though, Eric. There's a John Collins blue to one ninety nine. That'll be for Atlanta. Here's Paolo Bencaro, just base. Let's see if we can find some parallels here. Eric, de Eric, desperate to name drop Matt Bosher, former puncher of the uh, of the Falcons. Cool. You're in Pennsylvania, so what, no Philly teams? No Pittsburgh, no Philadelphia? Are you born and raised in Philadelphia, in Pennsylvania? How does that happen? That just seems crazy. How team allegiances are all over the place. And there's Lori Markinen for the Jazz. 
you know, like putting some injury stuff behind him. Starting to play pretty well for Utah. David B. 24 out of 49. Monty Morris to 149. Austin Reeves really, really developing nicely. Can it just be different? All right. No, now I now I'm curious. What are your hockey and baseball allegiances? Bradley Beal, blue to 199. Sticking together there a little bit. There's AJ Griffin. Saw his auto redemption earlier. I feel like no offense to AJ Griffin, but I feel like I feel like he should not be a redemption. Baseball's Blue Jays, hockey's Red Wings. Man, that is all over the place. All right, two boxes to go. I'll take a little dinner break after this. And then we'll come back and see if uh, there's some people. We, we got six orders coming in here. One from Mark, two from Sean, one from David, another one from Mark, and one from Wen Shun. So when I come back, we'll go through those orders. We'll see what direction they want to take us. At the moment, nothing looks like it's sold out. No one's getting into the second half of Mosaic. Nick did post more uh, Spectra pre-order, so maybe people are pre-ordering that. Hey, I like that, Eric. Yeah, you go against the, you're zagging while everyone's zigging. A De'Aaron Fox autograph. Kings were one of the last teams taken. William, last spot, Mojo Kings. 70% of the time, last spot, Mojo hits 100% of the time. Twenty out of twenty-five. They were just sitting there. Nobody wanted them. We got. Uh, Alondis Williams for the Nets to 149. Oh, I see. Oh, well, maybe maybe that makes the fandom a little more understandable if they're not even your favorite sports. All right, there's a Jabari Smith Jr. to 25. Nice. Montage insert, white mosaic parallel to 25. And it'll be for Houston, that's gonna be for Chris. Got another white mosaic parallel, five out of 25 for Robin Lopez. Cavs, Tristan.
Baldwin, Jalen Williams with a Y. Oh, that's Kevin Durant in his son's gear, 13 out of 25. That's kind of a, I like that contrast there. That's a cool looking card. Going to Phoenix, that'll be for Matt. Yeah, man, I, I couldn't tell you a single thing about Supercross or Motocross, but I do, uh, I do like, I do enjoy racing, so. You know, if it's on TV, I've, 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 I'm sure I've watched, I've watched some races. Chet Holmgren. Another Ben Caro. Cunningham to 99 for Detroit. Ben Caro's just a base. We just, we need to find something more interesting here with Paolo Ben Caro for Sean in Orlando. Well, you need to get the same glass. But I was hoping for some more, more base card parallels. And there is an overdrive, Jaden Ivy. All right, next. Yeah, I want a motorcycle. That's something, that's something I want to get at some point, someday. I had a buddy, I have a buddy who's uh, lived in LA for a little bit, but he's originally from Pennsylvania, from Allentown. And um, he had a really cool Triumph motorcycle. That was really sweet. What, I don't know what year it was. It was a little on the older side, so it was easy to kind of work on. All right, final box, ladies and gentlemen. We'll do a quick little recap after this. Good luck, and let's see what we got. Good luck, everyone. No Bamba. Got Steph Curry. Storm Chaser, is that kind of, that's a cool looking insert. And then we got the Isaiah Mobley. 92 out of 99, looked good in Summer League. Evans brother. Garza, what's going on? Just noticed you in the chat. How are you? In the Twitch stream. Put up a, a little to everything? Prime time saying, I'm not sure what that means. Right, here's another Chet Holmgren. Got that swagger insert. Giannis. More Paolo. Blue Chris Middleton to 199. sure what I got for dinner maybe uh, I get I get, some, I get meals from the endangered animal restaurant I might have some California condor eggs poached California condor eggs mm. maybe some uh, some Komodo dragon 
steak. Maybe some whale. There's a piece of Zubach 99. Yeah, maybe, maybe a humpback whale. And a Nikola Jokic. Nice. Pictographs. That's pretty nice. That's going to go to Denver. That's for William. You know, sometimes I go scrambled, Rex. Just depends. Maybe just over easy is nice, too. Out of 25 is also nice. There's a blue Ogiano Obi to 199. Chicken and wing, a chicken wing pizza for dinner. I might. Oh, there we go. Some numbered stuff. That's what I was looking for. 50 out of 99. Paolo Bencaro montage insert. Nice. And that'll be for Orlando. That's going to go to Sean Maddock. The blue OG will go to Toronto. That's for Tristan. And the Avica Zubac will go to the clip show also for Tristan. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. Nice little break. Second half in the store. Some nice autos, some nice cards, some nice parallels. Love to see it. Some gold for the purple and gold. I like that. Got And the Paolo Bancaro stained glass, also nice. There you go, gang. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. And I'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye. Oh, no, wait. Sorry. Man, I almost forgot. We've got to give this box away. All right. So let's flip back. Almost. Jeez. Let's flip back to the list here. I was like, I know I'm forgetting something. So there's everybody right here. I'm going to alphabetize by your first names. And per the instruction, if you bought at least two teams, an even number of teams, half of that number becomes entries. So Aaron got two. That's one entry. Adam got two. That's one entry. Brian K got two. That's one entry. Chris Butler got four. That's two entries. David B got two. That's an entry. Matt Johnson got two. That's an entry. Sean Maddock only got the Orlando, but that worked out okay. Steve with two teams. That's an entry. Tristan got six teams. That's three entries. William got two teams, one entry. Other William got ended up with five teams for the purpose of the promo four count. That's still two entries, William S. All right, so let's just spot check this again. So I got Aaron, I got Adam, I got Brian, Chris, David B, Matt, not Sean, but Steve, Tristan, William G, William S. Perfect. All right, good luck. So it's a 1 in 14 chance at that Prism box. We'll ship it to you sealed. 21-22. Prism choice. 1 in a 6. 1 in a 5. 6 times total. Man, I really need to eat. I'm losing my mind here. 6 times total. 1 in a 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And 6th and final time, Tristan. There you go. After six times, your name's on top, and you got a box of 2122 Prism Basketball going your way. We'll ship it to you sealed. And uh, if you choose to open it and you get something awesome, definitely let us know. I'm Joe for jazbeescaserays.com. Now we're done. We'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.